My dudes, it's time. It is time. It is so fucking time for the super amazing wagon adventure. The turbo, apparently? Man, I remember this only being super amazing wagon adventure. Maybe it received an update I didn't know about? Maybe, maybe, maybe who knows, man. I, I, can, I don't know, how to tell. Anyway, I played this game like years ago. Um, I lost my save state, so we're gonna start right from the, right from scratch, so. Let's hit the road, man. We can start an adventure, we can go on a survival. Do I want that? I can't do that. I cannot do that. Alright. Um, any options to be made? I didn't do anything. Attack speed fast? Faster? Let's go for faster. Graphics, man. Oh, fuck yeah. Man. Man, are you ready? Are you ready for a wagon adventure? Man, fuck yeah, I am. Alright, let's start. Between 1830 and 1870, nearly half a million Americans migrated. Oh, what the fuck. Okay, thank you. While we get Thomas here, we get Frank and we get Susan. Can I do something? We can randomize them. We can edit them. Thomas was a fine gentleman. Oh shit. Thomas is a lady now. Thomas is a she now. Fuck me. Thomas was something else. Oh dude, you can actually... Man, you can do some shit. I don't even want that. What the fuck? Susan. Susan is a boy now. Oh shit! Let's randomize. Okay, okay. So we get Daniel, Pamela, and Margaret. Alright, let's go. They travel in their RST. What the fuck? Okay, maybe the text is too fast. So we get the standard wagon, which is completely average. We get the fantasy one. We got the invisible one. We got the fast one, the glitch. Okay, there are a few different wagons. So we're just gonna start with the standard thing. They set off into the what the fuck. Okay, maybe I should put the speed back on normal. Uh, Alright, fast. Alright. How do I... That all came down... What the fuck is happening? So one of my dudes is almost dead already. Day 10. Seeing some animals in an upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on what the fuck. Oh, it's WASD and... Oh shit, man. Oh, oh, that's a... What the fuck is happening, man? Oh, so we don't want to shoot the... Those thingies. A posse of bandits interrupted the hunt. Man. Gotta love those side-scrolling games, man. Oh. Fuck. We can do this. This is easy. Easy peasy, man. Oh shit. Never mind. Oh, no, no, no! No, I want the health. What the fuck? Okay. Yes. Ah, close. Another weapon would have been nice. Oh, yeah, fucking great. Man, super amazing wagon adventure. Turns out to be a super amazing wagon adventure, man. Who would have known? Oh shit, fuck me. Do we have a weapon now? Oh, we are, we are shooting with that already. So one dude got healed, right? Margaret left the wagon to look for berries. Okay. Yeah, get some berries, Margaret. On our way back to the wagon, Margaret heard a noise in the trees. A bear wanted the berries. Oh, fuck. Fuck no. Fuck you, bear. In its last dying breath, the bear let out a cry for help. A swarm of rabbit squirrels heard the cry. What the fuck? Fuck off. No. A med pack. No, I want that. No! No! Mar Margaret died. Margaret, no. Fuck me, Margaret. When Margaret did not return to the wagon, they decided to carry on. They reached a river crossing. Okay. Pamela had the brilliant idea to try to jump over the river. Alternatively, they could fall through it. Let's jump, man. They got a running start and leapt from the edge. Did they seriously jump with that wagon? Some of them made it across. However, they landed near a, a den of bears. Are bears gonna attack me now? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit! Oh, no! No, Pamela, no! Pamela, Pamela, don't die. 
Pamela, poor Pamela, man. Oh, we can collect the bear? What? Daniel entered into the Great Plains. Dude. Daniel came across a, a large herd of buffalo. Oh, dude. Dude, 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 dude. I can't tell which one of these are dead and which not. Oh, man. I'm digging the music, though. This is nice. Can I... Buffalo, 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 and buffalo. Oh no. Okay, I can't kill that one, that's really annoying. Let's try to get as many... Yeah. I think the stronger gun is pretty useless here. I rather need a... I don't know, a machine gun maybe? Or maybe a shotgun? Like that one? Please, give me... Fuck. Man, I'm getting all those buffaloes, man. Oh, fuck. The number of buffalo was absurd. Oh, no. Yeah, start shooting, man. What the fuck? I can tell that the number of buffaloes was indeed absurd. We should clear the bottom half and we should be fine, I think. Maybe? Man! Absolutely super amazing, man. Holy shit. Come on. I can do this. Some angry buffalo will charge the wagon. Oh no. No! Holy fuck. Oh, holy shit. No! Holy moly, man. Oh, no. Fuck. No! Holy moly, dude. Then I cross, came across a fur trader. Okay. The fur trader offered to trade down on new or faster wagon wheels for 54. Well, I guess it's better than nothing. So we got faster wheels now. Oh, 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 this is nice. This is indeed nice. Then heard this gun noises. What? Someone might need Daniel's help. Alternatively, he could ignore the gunshots. Do we investigate it? Fuck yeah, we do. Riding towards the gunshots, Daniel saw bandits. We are robbing someone. Oh, okay. Do I shoot now? Bandits fired down on the wagon from the thing. Oh. Oh, that's great. So I can't shoot them, but they can shoot me. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, this isn't too hard. Fuck hell. What? Dude. Okay, may okay, that might be hard enough, actually. Daniel died instantly when a bullet. Oh, fuck no. Daniel, no! Daniel. Fuck me. I can't read fast enough, so we're actually gonna uh, lower the attack speed. Alright, can we go on a survival now? No. Let's start another adventure. So this is the story of one party of three and their adventure. Okay. So it's a very educational game, right? It's about migration. We got Eric, Richard and Henry here. We got all three colors. White, yellow and black, right? No offense. Alright, let's go. Let's go for our trusty standard wagon, which is completely average. And on day one they said... Fucking hell, I'm still too slow on reading. Seeing some animals in an upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock on food for the long journey. Well, fuck yeah. Let me get those squirrels. Let me get those health packs, which do not do anything right now. Oh wait, so they run away anyway. Do I even have to kill them? No, I can get their fur, right? They're so unicorn in the clearing. Oh boy. The unicorns seem to be leading them somewhere. On the other hand, they needed all the meat they could get. What? Dude, follow the fucking unicorn, man. They followed the unicorn into a magical field. It's more of a flowery field. It was a unicorn ambush. What? 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 Dude, what? Fucking unicorn ambushing me. What the heck, man? I thought this is 2017 and we love each other and shit. Unicorn kin or not, you know. Then a dragon attacked him. What? Now a fucking dragon attacks me. That's fucking great. I can't escape that one dodge me. Man, suck a dong! 
What? Oh. I thought he was charging at me. You unlocked the fantasy. Oh, nice. Eric left the wagon to look for wild berries. Berries. Alright. Get them berries, Eric. On his way back to the wagon, Eric noticed an entrance to a cave. He decided to investigate. Did he? I don't think he did. Let's go. Eric, fuck that cave. Eric, you know you're gonna die. Eric, is this here? I can still shoot inside. It was very dark inside. Yeah, I can tell. Upon lighting a torch, she found it was filled with giant bats. These are indeed giant bats. Let's just shoot from a distance. So we can maybe survive. Eric ran from the cave back to the wagon. They reached the river crossing. Man. Henry had the brilliant idea to try to jump over the river. Alternatively, they could ford through it. Or ford it. I mean, same thing, right? Now you're gonna jump, man. They got a running start and leapt from the top of the ledge. Yep, looks good. They only made it halfway across the river. They landed in the middle of some rapids. What are rapids? Oh, what the fuck? Do I could just go to the other side? What the fuck? Something, something, bolus. Wow, thank you, man. Jesus. Finally, they reached the other side of the river. Man, that was close. We almost lost two people. They entered into the Great Plains. You got sick music again. They came across a large herd of buffalo. Yep. These are definitely buffalo. Oh no! I didn't see that one. A bison rammed into Richard's head, causing severe brain damage. Richard later choked to death on his own vomit vial. What the fuck? No! Eric, no! No! That, that's not what I wanted to do! Now we got rocket launchers! What the fuck? Fucking angry buffaloes, man. Oh shit. Fucking buffaloes, man. I swear to god. Jesus. Chill. The fur trader again. Alright, let's trade. The fur trader offered to trade Henry a smaller, easier to maneuver wagon for 52 animal hides. I mean, sure, why not? Easier to maneuver. How easy is it? Is it just smaller? And then there was a tornado. Of course. The wagon was picked up by the tornado. Okay. Well, at least I can apparently still move in the tornado. Along with some buff, what the fuck? What was that? I think something happened. Hard to tell. Dude, am I? Oh shit. Please let me make it. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Holy shit, those was A wagon axle broke. The wagon was stuck. In the tornado? No, apparently not in the tornado. Alright. Henry left the wagon to walk to the nearest trading post, miles away. Oh no. Coyotes haunted him. Oh, I can still shoot sideways, that's convenient. Alright, circus. It was a long journey. Oh gee, Henry. Henry, my man, come on. Henry, my dude. Oh fuck, man. It was a very long journey. I can tell. Let me. Let me. Let me get that. Let me get. Actually, come on. Okay. Oh, that's just a Harrier strike or whatever. Finally, Henry reached the trading post. Yeah, finally. Is that fucker gonna kill me? The replacement axle cost all of Henry's money. Then he had to travel back. We had no money on us. Oh no! Oh no! No, we were traveling back. I didn't even realize. Oh, fucking hell. The journey ended there. The coyotes ate every part of Henry's body. Fuck. Fuck me. Let's go, man. Let's go again. Fucking hell. Jesus, man. 
So we got Pamela, Amanda, and Susan. All right. All Grills Club, apparently. We got the Punk, we got the Redhead, and we got the, the, you know, the Gilf. Um, and they, of course, traveled in the Fantasy Magical Wagon. They set off into the forest. Oh, dude. Seeing some animals in an upcoming clearing, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on their food for the long journey. All right, let's go. So it shoots in all directions. Kind of weirdly, but still. Nice, I guess. A bit slower, maybe? Hard to tell. Wait, what the fuck? I don't get any heights. It just disintegrates them. Oh, wow. So I can shoot like... Oh, yeah. This is, this is nice. This makes things easier. Alright. Fuck you, dude. Uh, we accidentally rode into a cave. How is that even a thing? Give me that. Oh no, fuck. Oh, what? Did they take more than one hit? I didn't realize that. Dude, that was close. Susan left the wagon to look for wild berries. Fucking Susan, man, every single time. I swear to god, if you go into a cave again. On her way back to the wagon, Susan heard a noise in the trees. A bear wanted one the berries. Can we just not kill the bear? Can we just walk around? You know, just wait. So, you know, I don't want to kill him. Is that a thing? Is that a possibility in this game? Can I do it? Doesn't look like it. Suck a dong. In its last dying breath, the bear let out a cry for help. Bear's extended family heard the cry. Man. It's almost like Turks. Gee. This is a rather fast weapon. I'll take this. You unlocked hard to bear. Hard to bear survival mode. Okay. Susan ran back to the wagon. They ate a good meal of bear burgers. Oh, fuck yeah, man. Oh, nice. It's actually healers. They reached the river crossing. Okay. So, okay, so we can either risk falling halfway through or we just get to the other side. I guess one damage is worth the risk of jumping over there. They get a running start and leap from the top of a ledge. Yep, run. That looks good. Is it, does it? Somehow they made it across. However, they landed near a den of bears and the large third woke the bears. Alright, fuck it. Oh shit, 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 shit. Oh, this kind of auto aims. Oh, this is what the weapon does. I see. I see. Aw, oh, I wanted it health back. Oh well. Okay, we are three people, and we're in the great dance. Susan came down with cholera. Oh no. Susan, no. Susan. Susan, why? And again, a large herd of buffalo. We could heal a bit. I guess. Oh, Jesus Christ, man. Yeah, it's kind of slow on the shooting part. Oh, man. Okay, this is fine. They can charge. We're good, we're good. We're good. Oh, that was. Holy shit. What the fuck's this? Susan recovered. Good Susan. Good for you. This is nice. Um, the fur trader. We only have 16 furs, so I don't think we can buy anything. 49 animal hides for a smaller wagon. But yeah, we couldn't afford it. Obviously. And then there was a tornado again on day 68. Yep. Yep, and we could still steer the wagon in the tornado, along with some buffalo. Oh. Man, this is intense. This is an intense adventure. Oh, fuck. I didn't realize we had no nothing, no, no juice left. If you know what I mean. Uh, okay, okay, this is good. This is what we need. This is definitely what we need. In the distance, they saw a woman in a red dress walking alone. Susan left the wagon to see if she needed help. 
Okay. What the fuck? It was abandoned in disguise. Dude. It was a bandit ambush. Bandits on horseback swarming in from all directions. Really? Oh, what the fucking hell? Oh, shit. Keep firing. Oh, fucking hell. The fucking horse. Dude. Some of the bandits had laser blasters. What? I will blast your ass. Holy shit. Hey man, I don't die. No! No, Susan, I mean. A laser blast burned a hole the size of a quarter into a... No. Oh no, Susan did not return to the wagon, so they left without a... No. They reached another river. This one was too deep to ford. What did they do then? A man had the brilliant idea to swim under underwater through the river. Alternatively, they could go around it through a desert path. Dude, we can swim. He took a deep breath and then jumped in. Dude, the music. Oh, yeah. They face deadly piranhas. Fuck them. Okay, there's quite a lot of piran piranhas. I need this weapon. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck, no. 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 We need the health pack. No. No. Fuck. No, Pamela. Pamela died. Rip Pamela. And angry novels. Fucking hell, man. Okay, it turns out this weapon is... This, this, this card is rather trash. Because we cannot clear fast enough. We can't clear the waves fast enough. Shit! The Nautilus Tusk went directly into Amanda's head. Fuck. Or Tusk. The party's journey ended there a mess of bloody naval horns. Fuck! Man. Alright. Last adventure. Let's go. We can make it. We can we can definitely make this. Come on. With Adam, Catherine and Walter. Walter? Alright, let's go, man. Fuck the ferry wagon. Fuck that shit. Let's go. Yeah, th this shoots a lot faster. Walter became ill. Already. Dude, what? Dude, he can't become Im ill immediately? What the fuck? That's not nice. But at least we can... Gather some supplies again. Do not shoot the stinking animals. It's not called the stinking animals, is it? It is in German, but... A posse of bandits interrupted the hunt. Fuck you, bandits. Alright, I can do this. Easy peasy. I can shoot twice and get the thing as well. Oh. Burn, baby, burn. I mean, it's very close range though. Can I? Eh. A machine gun arm bandit arrived. Yeah, fuck. Machine gun. Bandit. Walter recovered! Hey, Walter. Walter left the wagon and found some edible mushrooms. Did he? Or did he shoot them? Oh shit. I guess he didn't. Walter ate one of the mushrooms on the way back to the wagon. He felt funny. What the fuck? Walter battled his end demons. What the fuck is happening? What is this? What the fuck? Walter, no! Walter, what the fuck? Jesus Christ, don't... Painful memories bounce around his head. Yeah, I can tell. Give me the airstrike. Oh, gee. That was close. Dude. 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 Painful memories, go away, please. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hours later, Walter returned to reality and the wagon. Oh well. Okay. We unlocked the invisible one. They reached the river crossing. And they jumped over it. We will not ford through fucking water. Fuck that shit. Let's 
jump. Again. With a great running start. And we're over there. Some of these safely landed on the other side. And it's time for the Great Plains again. Walter got malaria. What the fuck? Walter, Walter, what the fuck? My dude. Okay, maybe you can make it, Walter. Who knows? Maybe today. Maybe today's the day, man. It's time to shine. It is time to shine. Get the rocket launcher, Walter. Fuck him up, Walter. Some angry buffalo charged the wagon. Yeah, fucking charge me. Oh, fuck. Okay, never mind. Joke. JK. JK, man. JK. Oh, no. Walter was trampled. Shit. Fucking hell, what am I doing? No. Fur Trader, help me. We only have 46 first. 55 animal heights. No. No, are we... Did we just need one more? Wait. He said 45. We will ignore the fucking gunshots this time. Fucking don't. Catherine noticed a strange smell coming from a nearby camp. She decided to investigate. Okay. Catherine. Catherine felt sick. Well, good job, Catherine. Good fucking job. Catherine saw an antique pistol sitting near the camp. She picked it up on her way back to the wagon. Really? On her way back to the wagon, Catherine heard a noise coming from the tall grass. I'm gonna get killed immediately. It was a deceased monkey. A. Not multiple ones. What the fuck? No. No! You fucking monkeys. Well, rip Catherine, man. Well, Adam... Adam, this one is on you, man. One heart. Only pistols. Gee, man. Let's go, bo boy. Do we wanna go around? No, fuck this shit. We're gonna swim. We can do this. Yeah, okay, this is a lot easier now. Not entirely sure on how fish give me fur, but whatever, right? I really do need that health package thing. That was also pretty close. And poisonous jellyfish, okay. Now we got all the fur we need. Fuck, 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 fuck. This is like the worst case. Oh shit. Okay, you somehow made that one. So it's, you somehow made it. Oh! Fuck you guys. No. No, 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 no. Go second deck. Yep, yep, yep. Not too bad. Not too shabby. A health pack would be nice. We unlocked the fighting fish survival mode. That's nice. Adam landed on a small island to catch his breath. Okay, good. That's nice. Adam noticed some supplies sitting on the beach. He left the wagon to investigate. Oh no. Oh yes, I mean... Adam then realized why the supplies were left there. The supplies were guarded by a flock of angry pelicans. Oh, what the fuck. What the fuck. No. Pelicans are annoying. Adam, Adam ran back to the wagon. Adam quickly left the island and swam to the shore of the river. Gee, Adam. Adam entered the mountain pass. Adam? Adam became ill. That's fine, he, he has one heart anyway. If he can survive, he can recover to full health, right? Food supplies were dwindling, so Adam hunted. Is this just... Really? A pack of wolves smell of the blood. Did they? Oh. Here they come. Oh, what the fuck? No! 
No, as a wolf pack item, Adam thought about the dog he left back east. He wondered what happened to old Caesar. Oh no, poor Caesar. The party's journey ended there. The wolves ate the bodies. Actually, just one body. Oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck me, man. Super amazing wagon adventure. Guys, dudes, my dudes. I'm actually gonna stop here already. Um, because playing for an hour this game it might become very repetitive very quickly. But it's a great game. It's a very neat little... Um, can you call it a minigame? I mean, I guess. Let's just call it a very casual, a filthy casual game. You can play it for fun. With your friends, if you have any. I happen to not have friends. I wonder why. Um, anyway. Super amazing wagon adventure. You can get it on Steam. It, it costs only a buck or something, or two, or maybe five. I don't know, how to tell. Um, yeah. I enjoyed this. This is a great game. For every now and then, maybe. Or just, you know, you just play it once and then just give up. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.